Hi Kim, John Racine here. I have to say I've been following you for a while now. When I first heard Lee McIntyre mention you in the program I was in with Lee, and he talked about what you did and took tremendous action. So I went and found you and I've been following you ever since. So I was really excited when you were looking for some feedback on what to put into Traffic Live. So I decided to record a quick little video for you and put my ideas in video so that you can see them. So you wanna make it rock, and that is awesome. So what are my suggestions? First, my recommendation is going to be an over-the-shoulder view of what's working now. I know you've talked a little bit about Facebook banner ads and some of the things that you're doing there. So I think when we're able to look over your shoulder and see what you're doing in your business that is successful and working and how you're getting results with it, I think that is incredibly valuable being able to model what you're already doing. Number two. Maybe make some case studies with students in the program. If you've got a student that says, hey, Kim, I did this and it worked out really well, maybe you can bring them onto a webinar or talk about it in a blog post or even a video on your blog or inside a membership area that says, hey, Joey tried this and it worked really well. Joey, tell us what you did. Just something like that I think is really valuable. We are probably going to have people throughout the spectrum of traffic knowledge and experience in the program. So when you can do that in little bits here and there, it's very encouraging to be able to see that, hey, I can do this. It's not as hard as I may think it is because a lot of times that's what people may be thinking. Next, I think some basic copywriting to get successful traffic is going to be really important. Basic copywriting on, in internet marketing online is really, really critical. And some of the areas I think that you could look at are maybe how to create a great banner, whether it's going to be a Facebook banner or a banner through a banner network or even a banner that's going to be put onto a JV partner's uh, delivery area for their product so that it wants to attract traffic back to our sites. Next, some basic swipes, whether they be email swipes, solo ads, blog posts, just different things like that. I think it's going to be really helpful in the copywriting area. Next, blog articles. Already mentioned that a little bit. If we're running with a blog, being able to have great content there, things from SEO and photos and all the different things that could make a great blog post, for example, and drive traffic to our blog sites and other types of basic copywriting that are going to be really critical. I know if you go into the JV area, having some great JV swipes and different things like that, I think would be really great. Continuing on, I think the next one would be add accountability for participants to keep people in a state of action. That's one of the biggest things that hold a lot of people back. Sometimes it's fear, sometimes it's lack of knowledge, a lot of different things. But if you add in a, an accountability piece, say, hey, there's gonna be your homework before the next lesson or the next webinar, go ahead and do this. Create a 500 word blog post or create a 60 second video with Camtasia or Cam Studio as a free option. And then that can be utilized in the content of the membership area. And last, and I think most important, talking about conversions and how to increase conversions. I know in my business, I have some sites that do well and I have some sites that don't do as well, but not knowing the conversions is what's gonna hurt a lot of people and even has done that to me in the past. So looking at what is a conversion and how can we increase it with the traffic that we've already got. If you've got a site that's getting 20 or 30 views a day and you're not getting any sales, well, there's definitely traffic there. What can we do to increase it and capitalize on that traffic? So Kim, those are my ideas. I'm really excited for your new program and hopefully I'll be able to see you there.